Hey, what's up, guys? My name is Stronger, and this video I'm gonna show you some Fortnite glitches, and these glitches are pretty insane because they're gonna help you a lot in winning a match. And some of these glitches are so fun to do, you really don't wanna miss them. So in this video, I'm gonna show you all of these glitches, and I will try my best to explain to you. So if you're gonna enjoy the video, hit the like button if you can, and if you're new to my channel, subscribe because I'm gonna be posting Fortnite glitches every single day in my channel. So yeah, without further ado, let's get into the video. Alright, guys. So the first glitch is gonna be obviously a public game mode glitch, and this glitch is so amazing because you're gonna get a lot of kills to be honest with this glitch so what you want to do is you want to go to these uh teddy bears you can find them on the map by the uh loot lake i don't know what, uh, the agency sorry by the agency and you guys can actually enter these teddy bears and this uh, actually a thing to disarm the teddy bear so if someone comes to you to disarm the teddy bear you can simply kill them because you see right now my back bling is kind of big and i have a pickaxe on my hand so if you don't have this back bling and if you're just playing like you know uh, with the normal skin you can actually be completely hidden completely invisible right now like literally you can get inside them and they're completely normal because you know people are gonna come and try to do this stuff and they won't see you and easy kills right and you can do this with any teddy bears in this place right here literally with any teddy bear there's like um 10 i think even more than 10 and you will be able to get inside them so that is pretty amazing pretty easy to do it's gonna work in public matches absolutely fine so yeah now let's get into the next glitch all right guys so the next glitch is actually a map glitch where you can see an incomplete structure on the water so if you go to the lazy lake and if you just like you know follow this uh waterfall when you go in the waterfall you can actually see there's like a fish pond and besides the fish pond you can see this structure is completely uh incomplete like completely incomplete that sounds uh i've never thought i would ever say that word or that kind of sentence but yeah anyway so you guys can see this incomplete um structure of the water and you can actually jump on it and if you're on pc you can actually see through the water like you know you're going to be seeing the fishes and stuff like that i was playing on ps4 so i couldn't see it but it's there and it's kind of funny like how epic games messed up with just water structure which was good before and now it's bad so anyway guys so the next glitch is going to be um in the party royal and you can actually win every time in party royal so what you want to do is you want to have these um crash pads and just take take two of them just in case and you want to go towards that barn and you guys know there's like a couple of game modes in the party royal where you can set the high score and you can actually win every single time in party royal by doing this so a lot of people don't know about this but you guys will know after you watch this video right so anyway so you see that uh place there's a high score right there and let's see the high score and uh we're still gonna beat that in in one second or in few seconds so anyway so the high score right now is one minute and 52 seconds right almost 53 seconds so place a crash pad right here where i'm gonna put and once you have that you wanna uh start this game mode and jump on the crash pad and then bam Four seconds I completed it in almost four seconds I mean almost five seconds but it's like four point something let's see how much is it 4.85 seconds and you can do this every single time in part real game mode and people will be surprised because it's impossible to get this score by playing legit like you know, legitly uh, or allegedly what's that word I, I I don't know those words so anyway guys so this is how you can set the high score in part real and people will be surprised as I said and you really need to try these so yeah now let's get into the next glitch Alright guys, so the next thing is gonna be, you can actually use the commands. So, you don't have to do anything, simply type slash on the chat and uh, um, I'm gonna click join. And when you click join, you will see there's gonna be some suggestions. So, I'm gonna type in join game now because there's a uh, join game on suggestion. And when you type that, you will see all the joinable lobbies. And once you have seen that, you can type the name that you wanna join. And uh, you see i can see all the names and i'm just gonna put one name and i know this is the uh not so much reliable um uh, option to join people but it's there so i just wanted to mention that and when you click that it will actually let you join the player so it's there i just wanted to know that there are commands in the game right now and uh, it will take a lot of time to join people like you know by just typing you can simply go to the menu and join them but still it is there the commands are there just like minecraft and it's really good to see something that is in minecraft and also in fortnite so now let's get into the fifth glitch all right guys so fifth and sixth glitch is gonna be in creative and i'm gonna say you don't really have to miss these glitches because they are so fun to do so start your creative in the meadows island and go on the edge of the island and now what you want to do is you want to have um 
couple of things like you need to have some mats and you cannot build outside right but i will also show you how to build outside so build some structures like this and now uh, get some mats and you need to have some plane quad crusher and also a macro bot okay so once you have all of these things you just have to drop them and now i'm just going to drop some materials as well because we have to build outside to actually uh do the glitch so yeah <clears throat> and sorry my voice just broke there so anyway so once you're outside uh, bring up the mats and now you can build so this is not the glitch though this is not the glitch to build it's it's just there so yeah now get the quad crusher macro robot and the brute uh, i mean brute is a macro robot so anyway the plane so place all of these things and once you have placed all of these things um now let's start with the quad crusher okay so if you take the quad crusher inside the water you can actually swim under the water so it will take you under the water outside the barrier of the water and it will actually uh, uh, kill you, but you guys have to leave the um, water, I mean, leave the quad crusher before it kills you. So I'm just going to do that and I will show you guys how to swim in the water. And that's kind of a good because uh, there's no option to um, scuba diving. Is there? No, no, there's no uh, option like that in Fortnite. There's in Minecraft though. Go play Minecraft. It's a pretty good game. So anyway, so take the quad crusher inside the water and leave the quad crusher. That's what you got to do. And with the macro bot guys, you're gonna be surprised. Like literally, you're gonna be surprised because it's so fun to do, and it will let you. Uh, I'm gonna show you what I mean by that. So you see, I can swim under the water, and I can stay inside the water as long as I want. But I'm not gonna do that because uh, it takes health. Um, it's gonna take your HP. So yeah. So now with the macro bot, it's pretty simple. Take the macro bot, and for some reason, it floats. It literally, it literally gonna float on the water and this is kind of ama amazing thing you can do in creative right now because nobody knew that Macrobot can actually go into the water and float instead of getting destroyed so the Macrobot is gonna float and if you jump it's gonna stay into the jumping um, um, stance I don't know what to say animation yeah jumping animation and it will be like that and if you boost it's gonna be in the boosting animation so this kind of fun thing to do in creative you guys can show this to your friend and it's gonna be pretty good to do and with the plane you can stay inside the plane and it's gonna take you in the water just like the quad crusher I guess so it's not a big deal so anyway so this is gonna be the fifth and sixth glitch and now let's jump into the seventh glitch Alright guys, so the seventh glitch is gonna be the invincibility glitch and I already posted this glitch like two days ago But I wanted to add this in my compilation video because this glitch is so overpowered so insane and you can do it every single time So there's a um, stack right there. Uh, I think it's a haystack or shack, whatever you call it It's right there in this place. If you enter that it's it's gonna make you completely invincible like literally bulletproof no one can shoot you with the rockets or anything like that and you cannot even destroy this by building literally it's gonna be fully invincibility method to be in fortnite so i'm just gonna get my other account and i will shoot some rockets on myself and you guys will see it won't uh damage me like you know i'm not gonna take a single amount of damage and this this is pretty insane because um this works in almost every single game mode squads duo solos whatever you play you can be in a god mode invincibility bulletproof um and whatever you call it you can be like that in fortnite and you see if you guys don't believe me i can actually damage my other account but my other account cannot damage me so it is something you guys can do it right now in fortnite and uh, the next glitch is going to be um one of the best glitch that you can do right now literally you can be the og default skin in fortnite so what you want to do is you want to simply go to the part real game mode and go to the place where you can actually change your appearance aka the uh telephone booth which is not the telephone booth anymore in fortnite you can just change your clothes and stuff there so anyway enter the telephone booth and you need to have the skull ranger skin okay without that you cannot have this uh, og default skin so go to telephone booth change yourself to a skull ranger skin and make sure you have the white variant of that so uh edit style and choose the white variant and um accept that and go back and now you wanna enter the um telephone booth again so once you have the white one uh, enter the telephone booth again and choose the different uh, variant which is the green one so that's what i'm gonna do right now i'm gonna choose the green one um and once you change to the green one go back and once you go back you guys will see that you're gonna be og default skin so this glitch is pretty amazing because i really miss these og defaults and those were the actual default skin i'm not gonna say the new one is the default skin because it's not acceptable okay by the ogs so anyway guys this is how you can be og default skin in fortnite chapter 2 season 2 and all of these glitches are pretty amazing you guys really have to try these so if you're gonna enjoy the video hit the like button if you can and if you're new to my channel subscribe because i'm gonna be posting fortnite glitches every single day in this channel and you guys 
probably love my channel, right? Because I, I show you how to win game by cheating and stuff like that. Uh, I kind of hate myself anyway. So this is the video, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. And by any chance, if you didn't like the video, you can hit that dislike button twice. There's not any problem with that. And uh, I'll catch you guys on the next one. Peace out.